Have you noticed how popular the phrase at the end of the day has become in the last few years? How overused it is? Today, I celebrate at the end of the day with a fitting tribute not to the innocuous phrase, but rather to all who have embraced this holy of holies and by using it in such overabundance that it drives me crazy. What then in conclusion may I briefly, obviously, essentially be principally as well as Prince Upley for our final analysis closed by our review or summary while taking everything into account as we either dot our I's and cross our T's or conversely cross our I's and dot our T's, whereby, wherefore, and whereas, while keeping in mind that in general, we'll put in a nutshell in order to make a long story short, that both all intents and purposes as well as all intents and purposes, both past, present, and future tense, that therefore considering thus in action, in word, and deed, as well as indeed bluntly stated, the bottom line is, we'll wrap things up, come to the point, summarize all together and all together, while lastly, finally, ultimately knowing that at the end of the day, that all that is, is, while all that is not, is not, as we bid you adieu, au revoir, and goodbye, while categorically knowing, intrinsically, that brevity is the soul of twits, even as repetitious banality of trite phrases, the very glue of great thinkers, great minds, and that at the end of the day, it is the rote repetition of fluff and foo for all that allows our bodies, minds, and spirits to soar. May God bless and have a nice day.